It's the Daily News and we're here in Avrosi for National Autism Week and I have with me MP for North Ayrshire and Arne. Patricia Gibson, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Patricia, it's been a wonderful turnout today. What's your thoughts on today compared with last year? Well, this has become an annual event in our Drossen Library and you can see it's very well attended. Lots of people uh, living with autism, lots of people with relatives, close friends with autism, all turning up today to offer each other fantastic support, to share experiences. It's a great day and I'm very delighted to have been invited here and I'd like to thank San Fernando for inviting me. Um, autism, of course, is something that is creeping up the agenda and quite rightly so. Um, next week in Westminster, um, there's going to be the launch by the Na National Autistic Society of the Too Much Information campaign. And that's a three-year campaign aimed at raising awareness of autism. And the National Autistic Society found that 87% of people who live with autism feel that the public are simply not well enough informed about it and they don't really understand it. So we've got a real job of work to do. The reason why we need to raise awareness and understanding of autism is because people who live with a condition feel very excluded and isolated and this has huge impacts on, on young people who grow up with autism. They're excluded in school, in all sorts of ways, even later on in life they're even excluded from the job market. They face judgmental attitudes, they face isolation and it can be a very painful condition from that from that perspective. I have with me Kenneth Gibson, the SMP candidate for Cunningham North. Nice to meet you Kenneth. Nice to meet you too. What a turnout. It's been fantastic. Kenneth, what does it mean to you to have these events? Well, I think it's really important that we raise both awareness and understanding of autism. There are so many people in our society who don't really understand what autism means. And I think that there's been a number of uh, important developments very recently which should change that. Uh, first of all, we had the first ever uh, National Autism Awareness Week just last month in Scottish schools. And I think that helps young people to understand what families with autism and young people with autism go through. Uh, because many autistic children are actually bullied in our schools at the moment and that's something we want to prevent. Also the new TV series, The A Word, I think has also been really important actually in raising awareness. A lot of people who have got no connection with autism have been able to watch that and they realise the individual human struggles that families with autism go through. George's Marvelous Magic is here with us today. Hello George. Hi there, pleasure to meet you. Now, I believe I'm going to get a wee trick played on me. Yes indeed, um, I've got a little pack of cards here. I thought I'd get you to reach in and pick out any card. Not that one. I'm okay, you can have that one. Excellent. I, I'm also going to ask you to sign the card so we know that it's your card. Okay? That's great. I'll take the pen. Excellent. I'll show that to the camera, make sure everyone sees that. Excellent. Um, what we're going to do, I'm going to take your card and we're actually going to place it back into the pack of cards. Now, would you be impressed if I could make your card jump to the top of the pack? I would be very You'd be impressed. impressed. Excellent. I would be so very I click impressed. my fingers and it's done. Right there on the top of the pack is your card. <laughs> huh? We'll do one better. How about this? We'll take your card, we'll place it in my top breast pocket there. Huh? Could you hold your other hand out for me, nice and flat? And place your other hand on top of the pack. Perfect. Sandwiching the cards between the hands. I'm going to reach in and I'm going to pull out one card. Would you be more impressed if I could switch the cards? I would be very impressed. See, I've done that already. It looks like that. Wow. See it up here? <laughs> it's just a, a two. We'll get rid of that. Don't need it. But would you be more impressed if I could make the rest of the cards vanish from between your hands right now? Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. I'd be very impressed. Very impressed. Guess what? I've already done that. Made them all vanish. Have a look. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Ayrshire Daily News, we are live in Abrosson for National Autism Week. It's been a fantastic morning. There's been coffee, there's been cakes, strawberry tarts. We've been in interviewing MPs. Suzanne Fernando, let's do it. What's it been like, what's it been like today? Oh, it's been absolutely fantastic. What a brilliant time we've had, John. Definitely. We had uh, guest speakers who were brilliant, chatting to 
to everybody throughout the day. We've had loads of donations of tea, cakes, raffle sandwiches, raffle prizes, your good selves as always. Brilliant. Yeah. To it's have been you. a great awareness morning though, hasn't it's it? Been it's been fantastic. Been fantastic. Definitely raising like, awareness. I know. It's just such, unfortunately, it is in today's society still a bit of a taboo <laughs> subject. Yeah. But today, I think bringing the whole community together yeah. and raising awareness, and it has really, really helped many, many families who turned up today. Lots We're going to get here. lots more out. We tried to go live earlier on, but we couldn't get a signal, you know, good enough signal, really. Um, but we're here live now, but we have to taken a lot of video. We've interviewed quite a lot of people, MPs, people who can cause change, as well as yourself, of course. It's been an exciting morning, it really has. It's been brilliant. I'd just like to thank you, you and Isha Daily News, for coming along today. And, and Robert, Robert here as well. Robert. Give us a high five, Robert. Give us a high five. Don't Hi, you know, what else do not like? And we also have the magician. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Let's do it. Time for magic. Let's do it. Excellent. Um, oh, so I've got to show you one last little card choice here, man. Um, do you know the story of King Arthur? Yes. Do you know the story of King Arthur? Excellent. And the sword called the Scalibur. Yeah. Yep. What we're going to do is we're going to reach in here. Um, we're going to get to so take out any cards. Anyone at all. Oh, not that one. I'm not looking. Excellent. And I will bring you to. I've got a pen there. Where uh, the pen? Have you seen that? Where the pen? We've not got the pen. He's lost his pen. It magically disappeared. It is. Yes. There we go. Yeah. Take the pen yeah. and say your name on the card. On the face right. of the card. I'll do it differently because I've never done this trick with you before. I know. I know. Right. 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 Right.